Have you ever wondered how you would sound like on Mars? If you have then you may want to listen to the different sounds in this video and hear how they actually sound like on the red planet. Because you see Mars has an unusual atmosphere compared to Earth with very different temperature, density and chemistry. These differences have different effects on the sound you would hear on Mars. So let's find out what you would actually sound like on Mars. Before we get to the actual sounds, we need to understand how sound really works. When we hear sound, what we're really experiencing is our eardrums vibrating. The vibration comes from waves of pressure that travel to our ears from the source of the sound. To get to our ears, the waves need something to travel through, like air. Sound waves can travel through liquids and even solids, but most of what we hear comes through the air. So you may be wondering what's different about Mars. Mars has an unusual atmosphere compared to Earth, which would have three main effects on the sounds you would hear. First is the speed of sound. Sounds produced in the cold Martian atmosphere would take slightly longer to get to your ear. With an average surface temperature of around negative 81 degrees Fahrenheit, Mars has a lower speed of sound, around 540 miles per hour compared to about 760 miles per hour on Earth. You probably wouldn't notice it up close, but over longer distances, you might. Second is the volume. The sound level you would hear would be automatically lower on Mars. The Martian atmosphere is about 100 times less dense than on Earth. That affects how sound waves travel from the source to the detector, resulting in a softer signal. On Mars, you'd have to be much closer to the source of a sound to hear it at the same volume as you would on Earth. Third is the sound quality. The atmosphere of Mars, made up of 96% carbon dioxide, would observe a lot of higher pitched sounds, so only lower pitched sounds would travel long distances. This effect is known as attenuation, a weakening of the signal at certain frequencies, and it would be much more noticeable the farther you were from the source. Put together, these three impacts would change how you would sound in the atmosphere of Mars. Of course, if you were on Mars, you would have a space suit on, which would not only help with clear radio communication, but also to breathe as well. So if you were standing on Mars, you would hear a quieter, more muffled version of what you would hear on Earth and you would wait slightly longer to hear it. But the biggest change to audio would be to high pitched sounds, higher than most voices. Some sounds that we are used to on Earth like whistles, bells or bird songs would almost be inaudible on Mars. So let's listen to some familiar sounds from Earth and how they would sound on Mars. Hello from the children of planet Earth. Hello from the children of planet Earth. That's one small step for man.
Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe.